Hello, good evening, everyone. Hello, hello, Jose Carlos. Hello, Kevin. Hello, Candelaria. Hello, Jose Walter. Hello, how, hello. how good are you? Good evening. good evening. How are you today, you guys? ¿Cómo están el día de hora? How are you? Good, bad, so so. How are so, you today? So. I so so. Why? What happened, mister? Mr. Kevin, what happened? Even... I am sorry. Yeah, I know. I know. Work is hard, right? What about you, Mr. Jose Carlos? How was your day? Very tired. Oh, very tired. I work huh? I work 24, 24 hours. Mr. But yesterday you enter or today? Sunday. Sunday. Sunday to Friday. Oh, but you work like I I, I, I enter to my work uh, the Sunday. Uh, uh, but my work is Sunday to Friday. Oh but do you work like right now when you are in the work? Yeah, right oh. now I am I am I am working. Oh my goodness, mister, how do you do it? Because <laughs> What happened with the emergencies? How do you do it? Uh, I am alert. Mm -hmm. I am alert. My cell phone is oh. on, on uh, uh, all day. Oh, I understand. Oh my goodness, mister. That's super awesome, mister. That's nice. Hello, Janetty. Hello, Eric. That's awesome. But I feel I'm so sorry that it's super tiring. Don't worry. I know God will give you the strength so you can like finish all your work. Okay. Pero sé que ustedes pueden y, y tienen la fortaleza para terminar, ¿verdad? Cada día. Because I know it's hard. I know it's super hard. But you got this, okay? Ustedes pueden in. We are almost done with this module. Ya casi finalizamos este módulo. We finished on Thursday. Finalizamos el Thursday, que es jueves, okay? And uh, by the way, I already asked about the diplomas. Ya pregunté sobre los diplomas. And yes, you will have diplomas. Y sí, van a tener su diploma, eh, pero le va a aparecer en la plataforma. Yo sé que ahorita les aparece ahí un, un pequeño como mensajito y ustedes me dijeron, Miss, pero nos aparece ese mensaje. Es que ahorita todavía no se han habilitado los diplomas, pero primero de mañana o el jueves por la mañana van a estar habilitados quienes hayan finalizado la plataforma. Así que sí, eh, check the platform. If you have any, everything finished, Si tiene todo terminado, well, les va a aparecer, ¿ok? Um, what else, what else, what else? Y sí, el próximo module, it starts in one week, I guess. Creo que en una semana les va a iniciar el, el siguiente módulo 2, ¿ok? Eh, principiante módulo 2, pero les van a estar avisando. Creo que ya les mandaron también el, el, el formulario que deben de llenar o les preguntaron por mensajes, me parece. Eh, y ya, yeah, ok. And if you have any questions, y si tienen alguna duda acerca del siguiente módulo, siempre ustedes pueden hacer las preguntas en el grupo, porque eso de la inscripción al siguiente módulo les va a apoyar un gestor. Yo no puedo inscribir a nadie, solo puedo este, ayudarles con cuestiones de la clase, pero inscribir no puedo. Así que ahí en el grupo ustedes ponen a cómo puedo, si no les han escrito o enviado un mensaje o llamado. Pueden escribir en el grupo, ¿cómo puedo hacer para inscribirme en el siguiente módulo? Recuerden una vez más, esta semana, mañana o pasado, les va a aparecer habilitado su diploma. Sí, ya finalizaron la plataforma, me acabé de recalcar. Que si la finalizaron, les va a aparecer disponible. Y ya, ya tendrán su first diploma, ok, for module number one. So, do we have any questions right now? Do you have any questions, doubts, comments? Thank you for coming. Welcome, Miss Rebecca. Welcome, Fausto. Welcome, Jose Walter. Yes. Hello, Miss. Good evening. Welcome. 
So any questions, doubts, comment, you guys, or no? Okay. No, no problem is the important thing is that you are here. Okay, lo importante es que estás, ya estás aquí. That's important. And so, so only a reminder, solo recordemos que ya solo nos queda mañana y el jueves y finalizamos el módulo. Así que tratemos de venir. Mañana yo les voy a escribir un, o igual, no, mañana. Mañana les voy a escribir antes de la clase para que, para que pues terminemos, ¿verdad? Las últimas dos clases y estemos presentes, ¿ok? Um, because they are important. Recuerden que son muy importantes. Every class is important, ¿ok? Thank you for being here. Gracias a todos por estar acá. I really appreciate that. Now, let's start and continue. Today, it is Tuesday, June 20th, 2023. Remember, that is English. Principiante module number one. My name, one more time, is Rosemary Alvarado or Miss Alvarado. And today, we are going to continue with the present progressive. El día de ahora vamos a continuar con el present progressive, okay? Because we were studying that, ya estuvimos uh, um, practicando un poco acerca de eso, but today we are going to continue with that, okay? And also with the WH questions and the no, uh, just no questions with the present progressive. We are continuing with unit number five. That is, what are you doing right now? This is the agenda. Super sharp but with a lot of activities. Este, esta es la agenda. Recuerden que está chiquitita, pero con muchas actividades, you know, that we do a lot of things. To start, wait a second. We're not going to start with this. It's another thing. Give me one second. I no sé qué pasa. Okay, there. There. Do you remember what was the yesterday's topic? ¿Se acuerdan cuál era el tema del día de ayer? Who remembers? It was a very important topic. Era un tema super importante. What was it? What time is it? Yay, very good. What time is it? And it was super important because we need to know what's the time or what time is it, right? Or what time do you eat or what time do you work or like that. Right now, we are, I am going to show you this activity in which you will see sometimes, okay? And it says, what time is it? And you're going to say, according to the clock, you will say, what time is it? Let's start with Janeri. Janeri, what time is it in this picture? Tell me, tell me. It's hard. Six. Okay, let's see. It's half past six. Oh my goodness, it's almost. It's half past five. It's son las cinco y media. But don't worry, me. That was almost, almost perfect. Very good. Thank you. Let's go with next one. Help me, please, Esmeralda. Help me, please. Hello, Miss. Hello. 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 How are you, Miss? I'm fine. That's good. Very good. That's good. That's good. What time is it here, Miss? Las dos en punto. It's two o'clock. Okay. Excellent. Thank you. What about next one, Miss Rebecca? What time is it? Ahorita le digo, Miss. Mm -hmm. Son las cuatro en punto, Miss. Okay. Este son um, at four o'clock. Mm -hmm. It's four. It's four o'clock. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Thank you. Let's go. Next one. Uh, Eric, what time is it? It's... Son la... past... No, no. No, mm. eh, es, son las eh, diez y media o once y media, no se entiende. Pero, digamos las diez y media. ¿va? It's ten o'clock. Ok, it's a las diez y media. No, no, perdón, es it's half past ten. Half past ten, ok. Very good. Thank you, mister. 
Let's go with next one. Help me please, Kevin. What time is it? It's seven o'clock. Okay, that was super easy, right, mister? Very good. Thank you. Let's go, Jose Walter. What time is it? Aquí sería las la una la una y media. Ajá. It's far past one. 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 Okay. Let's see. Excellent, Mister Jose Walter. Thank you. Let's go next one. Fausto. What time is it? It's eleven o'clock. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Let's go next one. Jenny, what time is it? Las seis y media. Jenny? It's half past two. Half past what? Sorry? Excellent. Jose Carlos. What time is it, Jose Carlos? It's half past uh, 12. Half past 12. Let's see. Yay. Excellent. And the last one. What time is it, everybody? So, serían las ocho y media. It's half past eight. Okay. Yay! Wow, you did awesome. That was super good. The only one that we have, it's like the first one, but the rest was perfect. But la primera lo que sucedió porque la manito, verdad? That they were difficult, but you did super super good, you guys. Thank you for practicing with me. Remember that it's important to practice, right? Now. As I told you before, we are going to continue with, that was a little bit of the time from yesterday. Eso era un poco de práctica del tema de ayer, ¿verdad? Now, right now, we are going with the simple present versus the present continuous. ¿Se recuerden que estuvimos as, en la semana pasada, creo que fue el jueves, que estuvimos hablando acerca del presente continuo? Uh, ¿Se acuerdan cómo eran estos verbos con el presente en continu continuo? Agregarle ING a los dos. Ah, exactly. Add ING. Porque, ajá, estamos hablando de este momento o del futuro. Exactly. Right now or the future. For example, what is the present continuous for, or the gerund form? El ING for walk. Walk. Ah, what about the ING form for cook? Okay. Cooking. Ah, and what is the ING for swim? Swim. Oh, perfect. Ahora, con el simple present, recuerden que pues el verbo se quedaba igual, solo cambiaba cuando era tercera persona, como she, he, and it, ¿ok? Like, for example, vamos a ir a hacer un poquito de práctica antes de que hagamos las preguntas, ¿ok? So here we have some sentences. Uh, let's start with Jose Carlos. Jose Carlos, can you help me with this one, please, mister? Uh, mister Green, mm -hmm. often have a barbecue in the garden. Ajá. Uh -huh. Often, ¿ok? Often have, okay. have or has. Has a barbecue in the garden. Okay, very good. Has, porque les comentaba que ese era el único verbo que cambiaba, ¿verdad? Al momento de um, pasar a tercera persona. Lo normal era have, y cuando era he, she, and it, cambiaba a has. Okay, let's go with the next one. Thank you, mister. Let's go with Janeri. Janeri, help me with this one, please. Me deja leerlo. Basic is question as it is in the mind right now. 
Uh -huh. So it's watching watches or watch? Watching. Next question. Okay, let's see. Yay, very good, Janeri. How do you know it's, it's washing? ¿Cómo sabes que es washing? ¿Cómo saben? How do you know that it's porque washing? Es una, porque es una, una acción que está haciendo en el momento. Exactly, right now, right? Aquí dice right now, and that's super important. Thank you, Miss Rebecca. Thank you. Let's go. Next one. Help me with next one, please, Esmeralda. Wait, okay, there. Who is a day? ¿Verdad? Si se dice. Ajá, twice a day. Ajá. Ajá, entonces sería. Uh, I taking, taking. I am taking. Taking, ¿verdad? One, two, or three, miss. Uh, one, three? two, or three. Okay. Three, three, three. I am taking. A... Can you read it? ¿La podrías leer, please? I taking, o todo. Todo, please. Twist a day, I... No, pero lo primero sería I y el espacio. Ve ahí vas a decirme la respuesta. ¿Cuál de las chavices que tiene I? Permítame. Tengo I, esta es una I y de ahí una de estas tres. Ay, ya me perdí, no entendí. Vaya, es que en la oración sí. sería así. Ay, y en este espacio que ves acá, va a ir una de estas tres. Ok. Ah, es que me estaba tapando la cámara, pero no entendía. Oh, I'm sorry. Ajá, ahí está. Ahí los tenía, pero ya bajé la. Ok, ok, ok. okay. Ah, entonces sería... I am taking a shower. Ajá. I am taking a shower. Mm -hmm. No, it's not. Okay. Vamos a intentarlo con otro, okay? Entonces sería I say Entonces la primera es I am taken. Okay, let's see. No. Ay, ¿por qué entonces no he entendido? No, la, la, en esta, en este. Eh, Porque está tomando un baño. Ajá, pero dice, yo tomo un baño dos veces al día. Entonces, no es con el ING. Es que recuerda que puede ser simple present o puede ser el presente continuo. Pero esta no. Ya entendí. Uh -huh. Entonces sería, ay. Hey, a Okay, I twice tw a day. Twice a day. Excellent. Yo tomo una ducha, dice, dos veces al día. Thank you, Miss. Don't worry. That was perfect. Um, give me one second. Thank you for trying. That. Was, oh my goodness. They give me the answer. Help me to read, Eric. Eric. Can you hear me to read? Solo me ayudas a leer, please. Please, please, Eric. Oh, no, Eric. Okay, help me to read, please, Rebecca. The kids are reading books at the moment. Aha, uh -huh. thank you, Miss. That was perfect. Let's go with next one. Help me please with next one, Fausto. Uh, ben and, and I go for Walt this afternoon. Okay. No, 
another idea. Ben and I are going for a walk this afternoon. Okay. Our... Yes, thank you, Fausto. That was perfect. Let's go with next one. Jenny, Jenny, let's try it, miss. Jenny? Susan, Susan is visiting Phil Denti. Is Phil. Uh -huh. Puede ser cualquiera de las tres, ok? Cualquiera de las tres, porque recuerda que cuando es. Pero, puede ser esta, estas dos son con el presente simple y estas con el presente continuo. ¿Por qué? Porque lleva ING. So, ahora Ajá. sí. Dime, dime, dime. Te escucho. Sí. Pues había seleccionado la segunda. Ok, la number two. Ok, let's see. Susan is visiting. No. No, 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 it's not the answer. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Y entonces, visit or visits? Visit. Visits. Mm -hmm. Yes, sí, sería visits. Porque estamos hablando de tercera persona y la tercera persona, recuerden que se le agrega S. So we have visits, ¿ok? Susan mm -hmm. visits her dentist twice a year. Very good, Miss. Thank you for your participation. Let's go with next one. Help me, please. Jose Water. My dad, always. Mm -hmm. Uh, is is reading a new paper in the morning. Okay, he's reading a newspaper. Okay, let's see. No. Sería reads. Tenemos reads or reads. Cualquiera de las dos. Oh, reads. One or two. No, two. 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 Yay, very good, excellent. That's super good. Thank you, mister. Let's go next one. Mr. Jose Carlos, oh my goodness. Jose Carlos, help me to read the sentence, please. We are waiting at the, at the bus stop right now. Excellent. Thank you, mister. Do you want to help me with this one, mister? Ay, todas se me van. Wait, this one. Cool. Can you help me with this one? Can you I read? Usually, uh -huh. I usually flies my height in the summer. A flies or fly? Flies. Okay. F Yes. Mm, no, let's try with another one, mister. I usually fly my kite in the summer. Exactly. I usually fly my kite in the summer. Very good. En este caso, flies, la otra misa que había elegido era porque eh, estábamos hablando de, en, con el IES es cuando hablamos de she, he, and it. Y cuando utilizamos el verbo así normal es porque estamos utilizando el sujeto I, you, we, and they. ¿Ok? Usually, that's something important. Oh, oh my goodness, all of them are appearing. I don't know why. Uh, Janetti, help me to read, please, this sentence. Is my family always have dinner together on Sunday? Excellent. Thank you, Miss. Let's go next one. 
Okay, now let's go ahead and continue, okay? That was a little bit of practice for simple present and present progressive, okay? Now we are going with the WH questions for the um, present progressive, okay? Ahora si vamos con las WH questions. Do you remember which ones are the WH questions? Si se recuerdan cuáles la, eran las WH questions? Where, who, why, uh -huh. what? Very good. Why, when, where, uh -huh. who, why, who, uh -huh. why, why, perfect. What? Ex uh -huh. What? Anything else? I think just that, right? Creo que esas son las más comunes. Very good. So, how? It, how? Very good. Yeah. So, here, as you can see, we have the different WH questions. Aquí tenemos las WH questions. Y en el caso de las present progressive questions, miren lo siguiente que vamos a utilizar. Va a ser el verbo to be, ya sea am, or is, or are. One more time. And then next to it, y a la par, eh, vamos a utilizar un subject. And then later, or at the end, we are going to use our, an ing. Okay, this will be the structure. Esa sería la estructura que vamos a utilizar. Like, for example, we can say, what are you Reading. Mm -hmm. Esa podría ser, ajá. Esa podría ser una. ¿verdad? What are you reading? Y este, pre, este tipo de preguntas, ¿cómo vamos a responder? Bueno, recuerden que siempre vamos a dar información, más información. ¿Ok? Like, for example, you can say, What are you reading? I am reading a book. I am reading the newspaper. Porque dice, What are you reading? I am reading a newspaper. Y así. Ok, then vamos con otra, vamos a hacer otra practice, like for example, when is she hmm, cooking, entonces para responder, como estamos utilizando el miren she, entonces así vamos a responder, entonces sería she is cooking, y ahora when in Sunday, ok. She's cooking on Sunday, or on Sunday. Mm, let's see, another one, vamos a hacer otra. Like where, where, vamos a borrar esto, give me one sec. Where, y ahora, where is he, where is he sleeping? And we can answer. Como estamos utilizando he, ¿verdad? estamos preguntando de él, sería he is sleeping in the bed, ¿ok? He is sleeping in the bed, ¿ok? So on like, the bed. On the bed or in the bed, exactly. Whatever of the two, cualquiera de los dos, ¿ok? Uh, so, yeah, like this, ¿ok? Give me one second. Vamos a ir a la whiteboard so we can write our own examples. Just give me one second. Give me one second. Here we have it. Okay. So what do we need first for the WH questions? ¿Qué es lo que necesitamos primero para la WH question? Do you remember? Uh -huh. Ah, the WH question, right? What, where? Who? Who? What Who? else? Uh -huh. Who? 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 When? How? Right? And then after that, y después de eso, ¿qué necesitamos? The verb to be. The verb to be, right? Which ones are the verb to be? Are, is, is, are, um, um, are, is. is. Um, are, is, perfect. Oops, sorry. And then after the verb to be, what do we need? Subject. Subject, right? They, por ejemplo, para el are, ¿cuáles son los verbos que utilizamos para el are? You, we, they. 
Exactly. Where, which ones are the verbs, the subjects for am? Um? I. I. And what are the verbs, I mean, sorry, the subjects for is? He, she, it. He, she, and it. Excellent. And then at last, y por último tenemos the, what do we need? ING. Exactly. ING verb, right? ING. Uh -huh. Thank you. Don't worry me, but that was perfect. Uh, so, for example, we can say, um, like, can you tell me one verb with ING, please? Women. Ah, playing. Playing. Uh -huh. Talking. Mm -hmm. Running. Spelling. Uh -huh. What about Cooking. the other? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Yes. What Living. else? Uh -huh. Thinking. Thinking. Uh -huh. Excellent. Okay. Now that we have the idea, and remember, always, always, siempre recordemos que al final de una pregunta siempre, right, we have the question mark. Remember the intonation. Y siempre la entonación al momento de hacer la pregunta. And so, for example, we can say, y por ejemplo, podemos decir, what are, I'm sorry, wait, what are you, what are you studying, studying, what, que verdad, y de ahí, tú estás estudiando, right? Y como podemos responder, I, uy, que hice, no sé qué pasó. I am studying. Hmm. What are you studying, everybody? Que están estudiando. So we are English. Ah, English. Y miren, para responder, super easy to answer. So first we have, primero tenemos el what, después tenemos el verbo. Bueno, el orden, vea, ya sabemos de qué. Y para responder sería, I am, siempre el verbo to be, con el sujeto, y de ahí, El verbo, el mismo verbo que teníamos en nuestra preguntita, pasa a nuestra oración o respuesta. Y por último, el what, ¿verdad? Nunca debe de faltar la respuesta a lo que nos están haciendo acá. Ok, so just to make sure, solo para asegurarme, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver otra. Let's say where. Where is, I'm sorry, no sé qué sucede con esta computer. Okay. Where is your mother? Hmm, can you tell me one verb? Name. Ah, no, where is your mother? Y un verbo con ING. Cooking. Ah, where is your mother cooking? Excellent, thank you. Y la respuesta sería, como está hablando de la mother, Entonces sería, my mother is cooking where, you guys? ¿Dónde? Vamos a ayudar la respuesta. In, ¿qué podríamos decir? Let's go one. In the kitchen, in the restaurant. Ah, ok. In the, in the kitchen, ok. Perfect. My mother is cooking in the kitchen. Y miren el orden. So, bueno, esta ya la teníamos claro, que ese es el orden, pero para responder, my mother is, lo mismo que estaba por acá arriba, vea, solo cambié de lugar, y de ahí cooking, que también estaba por acá, y where, que sería in the kitchen, ok, so, there, let's go with another one, vamos a ir con otro, vamos con when, those are the most important ones, when, de hecho en la actividad que les aparece en la plataforma, les aparece preguntas, vea, ¿qué están haciendo? What are they doing? What is she doing? Y les aparecen unos sonidos que estaban bien difíciles, por cierto, los últimos. Entonces, y tienes que poner, she is typing, she is playing, she is like whatever, right? Yo creo que la mayoría hizo ese ejercicio bien difícil. When are you... Hmm. When are you? Can you tell me one verb, please? One verb, one verb. 
talking? Oh, very good. Where are you talking? Thank you, Miss. Okay. So the answer will be I am talking. In the morning. Okay, in the morning. ¿Por qué sería in the morning? Porque estamos diciendo when. Cuando. Y la, el tiempo sería. I'm sorry, mon, I mean morning. Algo que aclarar que cuando utilizamos hmm, eh, when, también podemos decir horas, días específicos, ok? And like that, ok? Just to, to tell you and like you know this, ok? So, yeah. Questions so far about this? Questions, questions? Or no questions? Because I have a practice. Okay, let's try with a practice. Vamos a intentarlo con una practice, okay? Let's see. What are they doing? You have to tell me what are they doing. Me van a decir qué están haciendo, okay? What is he doing, okay? What is he doing? Tell me your answers. Mm -hmm. What is he doing? He is... Uh -huh. ¿Qué está haciendo él? In, the, in there. Clean, clean, Cl ah, clean, climbing, climbing, escalando. Ajá. Uh -huh. What else? ¿Qué otra qué otra idea se le ocurre? Climbing es escalando. Climbing. Uh -huh. Any other ideas? Ajá, otra idea que, que puede, está jugando, está like, any other ideas? He's, uh, he's talking a green. Talking to what? <laughs> uh, he's talking? No sé cómo se dice rama. <laughs> ah, to the, to the branch. Branch, se dice rama. Don't worry, sister. That's okay. And I was like, what? Oh, but that's perfect. Thank you. Anything else? Otra idea? Uh -huh. He is playing with the tree. Ah, está jugando con el árbol. Vea. Yes, mister. Sorry, no lo escuché. One more time. He is holding. He is Calvin. ¿Qué es eso, Miss? Can you tell me? Como colgar. Ah, falling. It's like that. Falling. Ajá, cayendo, cayéndose, como deslizándose. Right? Así, ¿verdad, Miss? I think that's what you mean. Creo que así es lo que quieres decir, right? Yes. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Let's go with another idea. Climb with the three. Yes, very good, Candelaria. Thank you for participating in the chat. That's perfect. Let's go with another one. What is he doing? ¿Qué, qué ideas le vienen a la mente con esta? He's reading a book. Okay, uh -huh. aha. Yeah. He's reading a book. ¿Qué más? El perro que está haciendo, yo que sé, hay muchas he's cosas. Resting. Que... Ah, está resting. descansando. Ajá, he's mm -hmm. resting. Ajá. What else? He's telling 
uh, his story. Uh, his what? Sorry, one more time. Spelling. T e l l e n g. T ah, telling a story. Ah, excellent. Perfect. He's Thank you. Smiling. He is what? The smiling. The smiling. Ah, smiling. Smiling. Oh. smiling. Definitely. Very good. Thank you. Uh huh. Anything else? That was perfect. This is the super bien. He's telling a story. Uh huh. Candelaria, thank you. Let's go with another one. Vamos con another picture. What is he doing? Huh? What is he doing? He's doing a grade. He is doing a what? Grading. Ah, writing. Okay. Yes, mister? He's studying. Uh-huh. He is studying. Uh-huh. Anything else? He is working. Uh -huh. Está pintando. How would that be? ¿Cómo sería? Está pintando. Painting. Uh -huh. He's painting. Excellent. Está escribiendo una carta. How would that be? He's writing a letter. Aha, uh -huh. he is writing a letter. Letter carta. Look, there we have it. He's writing a letter. He's painting. Excellent, Candelaria. Thank you. Let's go with another one. Pero le voy a pensar a preguntar a ustedes. One by one. Because I want you to practice. What is she doing? Uh, let's see. Esmeralda. What is she doing? She's, she's eh, saltando, no sé cómo se dice. Jumping. Entonces, she's jumping. Jumping. Mm -hmm. Excellent. What about you, Jose Carlos? What do you think? She's playing with the uh, rope. Rope, rope. Uh -huh. She's playing with the rope. The rope. Excellent. What about Janetti? What do you think about this picture? Janeri, Kevin, Rebecca. Yeah, um, she is playing. Here we are. Play, uh -huh. but only playing, Mister. Just playing. She's playing, right? Okay, so what about next one? Vamos a ver, let's do another one. Uh, what is he doing? Jenny, what do you think? What is he doing? Jeez. Uh -huh, he is. He is. Mm -hmm. In the bike. Riding? But, uh -huh. Can you say it again? Can you repeat this one? He is riding a bike. Okay. He is riding a bike. Thank you, Miss. What about you? What do you think, Fausto? He's... He's... Uh... Mm -hmm. Equilibrio, equilibrio, ¿cómo se dice? Ah, equilibrio balance, bikes. balancing. <laughs> balancing a bike. A bike, okay, perfect, mister. No problem, that's a good idea. Nunca me habían dicho eso, that's good. Thank you. What about you, Eric? What do you think? The picture. It's right. He He's writing, uh-huh. He's playing a bike. Ah, he's playing... With the bike, maybe? Está jugando con la bicicleta. Okay. Uh -huh. that, that's good one, mister. Thank you. 
What about, let's see, I have another picture, don't worry. What is she doing, Janetti? What do you think she's doing? Swimming. Uh -huh. She? Swimming. Is swimming, she thank is you, Rebecca. Uh -huh. Any other ideas? She's a floating. Ah, floating. Yes, thank you. Another one? Playing. She is playing. Excellent. Anything else? Dice, ap aprendiendo a nadar. Ah, she is learning. Learning to swim. Can you say it? ¿La podrías decir, mister? She is raining to swimming. Learning to swim. Raining to swim. Ajá, si la miras, mister, ahí está. Sí. She is raining to swimming. Excellent, she is learning to swim. Yes, miss? She is shouting. Ah, shouting, gritando. Shouting. Shouting. Gritando, Miss. No, shouting. Shouting. But what, what still will be the word? ¿Cómo sería la acción? Shouting. Showering. Ah, tomando una ducha. Like this? She is swimming. She is showering. Ajá, pero sí como está en la, en, la, en la presentación, mi? Sí, yes, miss. Ok, ok, perfect. Yes, mister, what do you say? She is swimming uh, on the pool. Ah, on the pool, perfect. I can see that you have awesome ideas. Muy buenas ideas, I love them. Showering, swimming class. He's in his swimming class. Excellent, wow. I think, no, we're going to skip this one. We are going to pass. Wait, es que tengo una de day and I want to do that one because we haven't done, Ay. give me one second. Okay, this one. What are they doing, everybody? What are they doing? They are, they are kids. Ah? Huh? They are? Kissing, excellent. What else? Who they wants are dancing. Oh, okay. They are dancing. Anything else? Any other ideas? They are hugging. They are hugging. Ah, abrazándose. Yes, hugging. Excellent. Wow, wow. <laughs> That's awesome, you guys. And let's go. Because okay. uh, right now, uh, yeah. Right now, I want you to create not four questions. I want you to create. Let's go with uh, two questions, okay? Um. So, what are you going to do? You are going to create two questions for your classmates, okay? And then here in the class, we are going to do the questions. And you have to, the one that does the question has to write the answer. Los que hagan las preguntas deben de anotar las respuestas o tratar de recordarlas, okay, later on. Uh, so, I'm going to give you one minute. Le voy a dar un minuto para que you can think of, para que puedan pensar about anything, anything, anything that you want to ask to your classmates. Okay, think, think, think. Please, please, please. I'm going to give you two minutes. Remember that you can use when, what, where, where when, what, who. Le voy a poner la imagen, so you can have an idea, okay? Para que tengan una idea. Y recuerden que todas van a ser con el you. So we can practice that para que podamos practicar un poco acerca de eso. This is the idea, okay? This is one example.
Yes, Miss Rebecca. I hear you. Aquí vamos a escribir las oraciones. No, no, no. Questions, questions, Miss. Ah, las preguntas, ajá. Yes, yes, yes. Aquí en el chat. Ah, uh, no, Miss. No, no, no. Just uh, write it in your notebook. Escríbalas en tu cuaderno y después las vas a compartir. Okay. Ajá. Okay, I think we are ready. Okay, let's see the questions, okay? And I'm going to start with Mr. Jose Carlos because I know Jose Carlos has the questions here, right, mister? Can you do the questions? Yes, do you have the questions, okay. mister? Yes. Okay, I can you do, uh, Mr. Kevin, please, do the questions to Mr. Kevin and remember, try to write down the answers, okay? Okay, what do you eat? What do you eat or what are you eating? Where, where, where do you eat? Do you eat? Hmm, are you sure? Where are you eating? Ah, uh -huh. yes, Kevin. Kevin? I am eating pupusa. No, but it's, he said? Where? Uh, he said, where, mister? Where are you eating? Where are you eating? Mm -hmm. I am eating in the restaurant. Okay, very good. Thank you, Kevin. Mister, do you have the other one? Juan, Jose Carlos, sorry. What are you doing? One more time. What are you studying? Excellent, Kevin. I am studying English. Excellent. Kevin, can you do the questions to Jenny, please? Kevin, uh huh. Where are you sleeping? Where where are you leaving, you say? Yes. Okay. Jenny, where are you leaving? House. Where? For example, I am leaving in San Miguel and you? Where why do um That. I am living in Ciudad. So can you say it again? I am living in Ciudad. Excellent. Thank you. Jenny, can you do a... Uh, oh, no. Kevin, te falta una pregunta, right? What are you eating? Ah, okay. What are you eating, Jenny? Huh? What are you eating? Eating. 
Remember, comer. Uh -huh. So. Mm. Mm -hmm. Nothing, nothing. I am eating what? ¿Sí te acuerdas qué es eating? Eating es comer. What are you eating? ¿Qué tú estás comiendo? Para responder sería, I am eating. Jenny, are you there? Jenny? Ajá. Uh -huh. Chicken. Okay, eh, so... pensé que no era conmigo, lo siento. Oh, I think es la señal, Miss. Sí, sí. Creo que por la señal, pero no worries, no worries. Uh -huh. Tell me. Uh -huh. I am, I am eating. Ya está ahí, chicken. Cheque, ok, thank you, Miss. Now, Jenny, can you do? Vamos a pasarlos a una pregunta porque we, we, the time is running. Tiempo se nos acaba. Jenny, can you do a question to Esmeralda, please? Mm. Y esta es la pregunta, Miss, ¿o no? Um, huh? When, what, where? Where are you from? Where are... Vamos a dejarlo, where are you living? Porque where are you from sería lo hey. de... Uh -huh. I am living in San Salvador. Ajá, excelente. Porque where are you from sería el verbo to be. Y where are you living sería con lo que estamos practicando. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Esmeralda, do a question to Jose Walter, please. Ok. What is your birthday? Ah, very good. But where is the verb with ing? Pero ¿dónde está el verbo con ing? Ah, ok. Vamos a, en vez de birthday, vamos a ponerle when... Are you celebrating? When are you celebrating? Ok. Recuerden que este es el orden. Siempre este es el orden que desde la que estábamos creando acá era when eh, are, are you, you celebrate, ah, celebrating celebrate uh -huh. your birthdays? Ajá. Like that. Ahí sí. Ah, excellent. Birthday. Perfect, perfect. Thank you, Miss. Es, eh, es mi cumpleaños, ¿verdad? Eh, no, ahí me perdí. ¿Cuándo vas a celebrar tu cumpleaños? Ah, correcto. Uh -huh. Sería I am uh -huh. celebration in celebrating celebrating November the two five. I am celebrating my birthday. I am celebrating my birthday. November. Uh -huh. In November. Uh, two five. Twenty five. November. Three. Twenty five. Yes. Oh, nice. That's awesome, Mister. Okay, and now Jose Walter, the last one. Can you do a question to Miss Rebecca, please? What are you sleeping? Where are you sleeping? Okay. I am sleeping at five to five to twelve o'clock p.m. 
Oh my goodness. I ain't. I ain't. A A.M. A.M. Oh my goodness, Miss. You go to bed so late. Oh my goodness. My baby not sleep. Oh my goodness. That's mm -hmm. sad. Yes. But but some month, Mister. Maybe me. Sorry. Later. Hey. It would be different, I guess. I guess, right? I don't know. Maybe in the future will be different. Hopefully, hopefully, Miss. Okay. Now, thank you, everybody, for participating. Uh, it's time. I know we haven't practiced much. Yo sé que no hemos practicado tanto, but tomorrow we are going to continue with this. Pero mañana vamos a continuar con este tema. Don't worry. We are missing some parts. Nos faltan unas secciones por ahí. So, and also in the manual. Uh, so we are going to stay here. Please continue working in the platform if you haven't finished. Si no han finalizado la plataforma, recuerden que todavía pueden hacerlo. And, and if you have any questions, let me know. Y si tienen alguna duda o pregunta, me la hacen saber. Um, so we are going to stay here. Nos vamos a quedar por acá. I hope to see everybody tomorrow. Have a great night. Take care. Bye-bye, everybody. Take care. Bye, me. Good night. Bye, me. Good night. Bye, Good night. Be safe. Take care. See you tomorrow. Good Los veo mañana. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Take care.